Hello, today I'm going to show you how to make a stop motion with Adobe Premiere. I'm going to do a new project and I'll leave it untitled. And get my pictures. I'm going to click File, Import. And here's my pictures, but they appear zoomed in and really big over here, so I had to make them into mini pictures. Oops, there we go. Okay, there. So they're the same pictures, but they're smaller, so they fit the screen. And you can click Shift and use the arrow keys to hide the ones you want. And then just click Open, and they should go over here. <laughs> and then I'm going to get them over there, so you can do the same thing, shift, use the arrow keys to highlight them all, highlight the ones you want, then hold down shift and then drag them over, and they are all over here, so, and when you make a stop motion you want to make sure your pictures are all in mid-motion and they go together so when you put them together they look like a video so if you want to play it you can click the stop or the space bar then stop it you can click the space bar too to do that and if you wanted to move pictures around you can click shift and then just drag the highlighted ones you want and then grab it by the top and carry it over. I can also show you how to make a title slide. So I'm going to click control A, which selects all of them and can move them over. So that way I'll have room for my title. So you can go to title, new title. Default still. And then I'll just type stop motion. And then to move it, you can use these and just click on them and move them back and forth until you get it to how you want it. So, and then if you want color, I'm going to make it bigger first, and move it over, I'll do the Y position to move it up or down, and then X position to move it to the center. You can also do some pretty cool stuff with it, but I'm going to change the color, the background color. So you want to make sure you're by background, and then you can click on this. I'm going to click ch ch check mark it, and then I'm going to do a four color. I'm going to do four colors, and you can just click each corner, like double click on it, and then select the color that you want. I'll do like a blue. This blue looks kind of pretty, so I'll click OK. And then I'll go to the next corner, do the same thing. Maybe I want, I don't know, purple. Mm, that's good, I guess. And then can do yellow. You can pick whatever colors you want. You just keep doing this for each corner. And then they kind of all blend together. It looks kind of cool. I haven't done a green yet, so I'll just do green. So yeah, that's what it looks like. And then you just exit out of it, and it will appear down here, and you can just drag it in. And then I can drag, whoops, all of these in. And if you have a space, you can click on it, and you can click or pull delete. Exactly.
kind of space. But you can click shift to and highlight them all to select them. But I'll just ripple delete this so they'll go back together. And so then you'll have the title and then you'll have your stop motion. So. And I'm going to click Control A. I'm going to move it all over. And then to make them bigger, you can use these. Bigger or smaller. This I want the title a little longer so it appears longer. So you can just drag it out until you get it the size that you want to be the length that you want. And so yeah, and that's a big space, so ripple delete, and then you'll have your title. So, yeah, thanks for watching, and have a great day.